<sighs> Dylan. Mm. Why, Dylan? Why? <laughs> I'm the <fly> tuna. <laughs> Yo, all my uh, pets' gear mysteriously vanished. Oh, man. Are you sure your pet had gear? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he had two tags and a collar. I mean, he's empty. You sure you're not confusing it with your first character? I'm sure. Because I've been, um, some of the quest items I've been receiving have been tags. I have mine, so I don't know. I was gonna, I was gonna say some of my trinkets are missing. <laughs> no, they're all there. Sell that shit. Do I have any open sun? I'll be waiting in the next area. No. Dylan's, go Dylan's going ham on that fucking target, though. Oh fuck! <laughs> I think the uh, first light just crashed on him. Mm. Oh man! Too much, man. Too much. The next gen graphics are too much. <laughs> <laughs> any consolation this load screen is taking like at least an hour i know i think that was part of the problem why it was <laughs> it was uh... i'm still in the load screen dylan have you loaded up yeah wow i need to go to the <laughs> bathroom though i'll be back if it take that long let's see if it takes that oh it finally loaded in <laughs> god damn this shit is that shit is lagging like crazy right now. Mm. I was just getting like one FPS. Oh, I found the phase portal. Dude, stop you, fucking moving. Your, uh, your dog is like trapped. Oh, okay. <laughs> he was like trapped in that little fucked up house. He's running back and forth. He's like, how the <laughs> fuck do I get into this shit? stuff. Well, I'll be there. So, uh, new druid card today. Kriparian exclusive. Oh, what? Yeah. Oh, you didn't see it? I thought I texted it to you. Yeah, I read yeah. It about it, but I haven't really looked at it. It's four mana. 
um, discard your entire hand and gain 10 mana crystals. Hmm. I'm not sure so, about that one. <laughs> that's, that's some super ramp. That's, uh, that's some insane ramp. So, the idea, basically, I actually think this card is, again, it's like borderline broken. Like, it could be broken, and it could not be broken. Yeah. Like, it, um, oh shit, all this fucking shit. Um, hang on, I'm coming. Alright. One, One. Two. Three. Seems it could be broken. I mean, just load like, up your deck with legends and then. Not not just that. Like, uh, I think the, the idea is, like, uh, Crip hit it right on the head. He said exactly what I was thinking. Um, you, you, you play it if you have, like, an Acolyte of Pain and a Blue Hoarder or some shit on the board. And then you dump your hand, and then just make sure that the rest of your deck is pretty heavy. And you win. Yeah. Or you hopefully win. Um, yeah, you know, like, uh... I, I don't know, like... It's so hard to evaluate the card without actually being able to play it. This one in particular, because you actually have to try to make the deck and see... Because trying to calculate the probabilities of like pulling out Loot Hoarder and Acolyte of Pain and getting those before you play the, the thing, that's like a really hard probability to calculate. So, yeah, that seems almost impossible. Yeah, but... If it works the way that we want it to, right? The dream would be you play something on turn one. Like, we, well, I don't know. You don't play anything on turn one. You probably uh, wild growth. Um, you probably like wild growth, or well, the way that Crip was saying is that coin innervate into that thing on turn one is probably not that good. You'd probably have to wait until you have a board already, like dump your hand on the board and then use it. And that's kind of hard if you want your entire deck to be heavy so that you can abuse the card. Um, but I don't know, I think somebody's gonna tr figure out a way to make that card useful. Like it has so much potential, but on the other end too, they, they don't. It's not even a card that they need right now because they just got Aviana, which yeah. I think is better. I can't carry anymore. Yeah, no, I, I, can't. I think Aviana's way better. Yeah. So I don't know. It's a hard card to evaluate. It's. I'm not sure what kind of deck it fits into. Oh my goodness, all of this garbage? My goodness. Legendary gloves. Mm -hmm. That I can't use because it's for Amber Mage. Hello there. You have a golden key, so if you find the box. I will let you know if I find that box. You're welcome. Where are you, Dylan? Dylan? Hmm? Oh, you're here. <laughs> I'm coming.
Level up. I'm a level uh, uh gold chest is uh, over here. Where is it at? Where I'm at. Ah. Money and nothing else. All that shit is garbage in there. Glad your chest had something. No, I'm just helping this guy over here. Like there's some dudes over here that give you stuff. Welcome, my friend. You're welcome. Yeah. Oh, damn. Your pet's inventory is full. Your pet has departed. Texting me. Twitch. Did you know I'm playing video games, bitch? Apparently not. It wants you to stream. <laughs> they want me to stream. <laughs> So like if if somebody were to make a deck, right, with two acolyte of pain, loot hoarder, two loot hoarders, um, uh, two wild growth, two innervate. One. Astral communion. The one, yeah, astral communion. Two astral communion, and then a bunch of big ass creatures. I don't even think that would be a good deck. Like, there's there's too much possibility of getting a really shitty hand and just losing to aggro. Right. Yeah. Seems like a dead card to me. But I don't know, I, I'm only thinking like something like um, Astro Communion turn one into Sneed turn two. Yeah, but how do you get it on turn one? You're gonna point innervate it. Oh, wait a minute, it's. What is it? It's like it's four, mana. it's four mana to do. Oh, that is even worse. <laughs> I would only think it's good if it's uh, one mana. 
Really? Yep. One man? Has better possibilities at least. Well, I think it'd be broken if it was one mana. Yeah, but then it's kind of worthless on turn four for ten mana. Maybe I don't know. I guess nah, because then you would like try to get really low mana cards in there, and then hopefully get an astral by turn four. And then okay, how about this? You have Jeeves in the deck, alright? Okay, and then, okay. And then, um, you have two Jeeves, two Lou Hoarders, two Acolytes, two, um, two, uh, hang on, two, um, What's the fucking card call? The one that... Astral <laughs> No, no, no. Yeah, that too, obviously. Um, but, uh... What's the spell? Nourish. You, you can have two Nourish. What if you make it a really low-cost deck, but you have a lot of card draw in the deck? So you make it almost like Zoo, but you have Jeeves and shit in the deck, so that you can play multiple cards a turn. Hmm. So, it, it wouldn't be that hard to dump your hand on the board, and then play that thing, and then when you you have a lot of card draw in the deck, naturally, so the following turn, you could like, or even the same turn, you could suicide your loot hoarders and your acolytes, and draw other things that get you to draw more cards, and then you just load up the board with your 10 mana. That might be able to make it work. I mean... I'm not even going to be able to try it because I already know it's an epic. I'm not going to get it. So, I won't be able to. I will be one of these people experimenting with the deck. <laughs> yeah, uh, I no feel like that's. Cards, bro. Huh? No what faith say, cards? No faith. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what happened, uh, Dylan? Oh, I think that's still too uh, slow of a deck. think it's best in a slow deck. Mm, I don't even know about that curve, man. You see, like, naturally you think it's good in a slow deck, but I think if it's good in a, it, it might be better in a fast deck, because that way you play it and you don't lose anything, and then you can naturally draw into things. You see, I don't know if you've played with Jeeves before, but I, I've been playing with Jeeves a lot. And I think that card is actually really good, and people don't give it enough credit. Um, you can do so, like, even with a deck full of 1s, 2s, and 3s, I can still play, like, every turn with 10 mana. And it use, like, all my mana. The uh, only problem, uh, though, is that, um... The only problem I've encountered is running out of cards. Like, I just fatigue myself. Yeah. Because I, I know I've played games even against like Handlock where they don't kill me. We we both go into the late game, and the only reason I lose is because I run out of cards. You guys go. Oh, there's a big ass chest over here. Set up a trap. With nothing in it. Oh, holy shit. It was a trap. Well, there could be something in it for us. <laughs> oh, I need to level up. Why does this guy have so much health? Attack speed, this one is poison damage, this one is fire damage. Uh, and he dropped nothing. That was garbage. Where's that chest you said, Duran? It was like north of where I am right now.
Oh, over here. Let's see it. Dude, they dropped nothing. That's what I'm saying. Like, they shouldn't drop anything for me. I don't know. All I know is that Avion is going to be broken as fuck. Cause that shit, like, it's basically the turn you play it, like if you play that shit on turn 10, it's basically like with another big creature, like a Yasera or something, it's basically like a one mana 5-5. Five five. Yeah. And if you don't take it off the board, you lose. Because then it's gonna be like a zero. The following turn is gonna be like a zero mana that gave you eight mana, which is broken. The thing though is that the setup for those those decks is gonna be hard because if you're gonna be trying to abuse Alviana, your mana curse is gonna be heavy. And you might not even have a mid game. Wow, was that it? There's no chess. Lame. Wow. So, guys, today I played against a patron warrior. Alright? With my warrior. Which is like a mid range warrior. It's a very strange deck. Don't even. It's it's like nothing you've ever seen before, i.e. garbage. Um, Was there no quester? For this? Yeah. Man's trash? Yeah, isn't this the main story? There's a quest here. We're supposed to go in. No, no, isn't that main story? No. That's a side, that's a side mission. It's the, it's on the side, on the side, it's, it's in, one on the bottom. Green? Yeah. So, I was playing with like a weird warrior deck that I made, it's kind of zoo, like it has stuff like Abuse of Sergeant in it, but it has some late game like Kelsey's on, um, which kind of combos with Sludge Belchers and the Noyotrons and shit like that. And uh, so I was playing against this Patron Warrior, and um, the guy... Like, I got him so bad, because I had, like, a slime on the... I had a slime on the table, plus I put a sludge belcher. Plus I, like, traded all of my stuff into his thing, and then I played Kelsazot. And then he had the patron combo in his hand, but he couldn't get through it, obviously, because of the sludge belcher that the Kelsazot spawned. So he lost. And he immediately friended me to tell me, um... What did he say? He was like, fuck you and the gay deck. I hope your kids get raped by 40 <laughs> niggers and die of Ebola in front of you. And he like spammed that shit like 40 times. <laughs> and I couldn't even delete him because, you know, the, the chat bubbles come up on the left. So <laughs> that shit was like, I, it, it was, there was so much of it that I could not delete him. I had to like, I had to like quick click that shit like, Ninja click that shit to get him off. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> and, uh, I mean, I did say something back to him. I was like, 
You're a fucking queer for playing that broken deck and then I deleted him. <laughs> um, so that video will be up on YouTube in like a week. <laughs> Do you have the comments on there too or no? I, like, you see like the first couple comments that pop up in at the end of the video. You, you definitely see the one where he's like, I, I, I hope 40 niggers rape your kids or some shit like that. You'll see that one, Bob. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. I was like, wow. Serious much? <laughs> right? I mean, you're gonna lose this weird deck, so you're not always gonna win with the fucking Grim Patron. Yeah, I, I don't know why he was pissed off. It, like, was he pissed off because of my deck, or was he pissed off be just because he lost? I I'm confused. <laughs> it's like, dude, you can't handle this garbage then. I know. Uh, Jeez, just relax. <laughs> dude, some people couldn't handle that, um, that garbage hunter deck I had. Mm. <laughs> All those, uh, <laughs> two mana minions. <laughs> yep. It's like, no, I can't handle it. Stop taking the board. <laughs> Keep killing them and they keep coming back. <laughs> 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 Fucking what's web spinner? Where did Gazrilla come from? I know. <laughs> <laughs> web spinner and the Gazrilla or uh, King Crush. Yeah. <laughs> Man. Can't believe it's not butter. Hmm. <laughs> Man, like that, that just ruined the day for me. Cause I was like, why is this community so fucking cancerous? <laughs> it's funny because, uh, actually had somebody, uh, a uh, friend me, and he was pretty nice. <laughs> and we actually stayed. Well, you know what? I have a lot of friends on my buddy list that are really nice, like really nice people. Like that guy that I was, uh, uh, he was recently like in, like the hundred legend ranks and shit. Mm -hmm. Like that guy was, he's really nice. He friended me after I beat him one day on the ladder, like, and we chat sometimes and stuff and. That's how most of the people on my friends list, that's how I've met them. Just from beating them on the ladder or, uh, or they beat me on the ladder and they friend me and they're like, yo, I like your deck or whatever and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm used to nice people on the ladder, mm -hmm. but I knew that when that, cause as soon as he quit, the fucking friend request came up and I was like, oh, I know what this mm -hmm. is going to be. <laughs> <laughs> I've only ever gotten one friend request and I just ignored it. I just wow. assumed that it was like some dude was gonna rage. I just like you, immediately. You knew, was like, you knew it was gonna be that Ebola cancer. It's like you motherfucker, <laughs> you got fucking lucky. And the game is built on luck. I mean, you can't help it that you get lucky sometimes. Yeah, I mean, look how many times have been have I been raped by a knife juggler implosion? I don't, I don't friend people to bitch at them. I just, whatever, move on. Uh, Dylan, I got a legendary shotgun. Mm. If you want him, hundred and twenty-two damage. You know, Dylan loves those shotguns in his melee class. <laughs> Huh? I actually don't need it. I got 128 on mines. I'm gonna sell it. Now. I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anything else. I have a 130 uh, claw. If you want the rare? Guys, I can't. I can't, I can't carry anything. I'll check that out. Ah, see, I found something for you. Yeah, I gotta portal back to town and sell stuff. That's what the pet's for. He's he the pet is already at the town. <laughs> oh wow. And my shit is still full. 